This is Tim's way. A nice cul-de-sac. Chelsea Lane. Got a big driveway for lots of cars here and a garage to the side. So if I go into the property. So this is a nice big hallway here. To the right you have a study or a fifth bedroom. And that's at the front of the property. You've got a downstairs toilet and then that's the stairs up the stairs. So you've got downstairs under the stairs storage there, straight through to the kitchen. It's lovely and modern, all integrated appliances and bath stools here. So from the kitchen you do have access to the utility room which again has appliances in here and that's facing the front there so if you go right so this has access to the garden via the patio door and again there's access to the garage here so you've got a nice big patio conservatory. Good size garden here. This is the view from the back. So very good size property. So if we go back through to the conservatory. Here. It's all the way out there. So we go, go through into the dining room, which is a good space in here, and then you've got the wood doors into the lounge. And again, this is back towards the front of the property. So it's a good size, good size lounge here, and that goes into the, the dining room. So back out into the hallway so we've just done a, a very big loop round around the property so again so that's the front door there so if i go upstairs i've got the window here then light so you've got a great big landing storage and everything so i'm going to start from the front of the property so back towards the front you've got Good size double bedroom, great high ceilings and beams there. A lot of storage. So the next one, again, you've got the sloped ceilings, and in here, again, a lot of storage and high ceilings. So opposite from the stairs is bathroom. The right there is the master bedroom which is facing the garden and again this one's got built in storage high ceilings and the beam and this one also does have the ensuite shower room so it's a nice good size little shower there and then the final bedroom again facing the garden um, it's got the air and covers in here as well 